Hey there, it's been a while since I've uploaded my first vlog, but I needed time to adjust and get our new home together so there is no footage of September. So welcome to October's vlog! We went to our first Sunday flea market in Volkshagener Platz. You got to excuse my, my German. <laughs> we just moved too far from home, but we did take a bus to get there. So enjoy the ride. I was super excited to see how this event takes place in Berlin, since it's kind of a tradition here. And people come to thrift cool stuff from an old watch to clothes to furniture. Here is like a thing that people look forward to do on Sundays, which it makes it so cool. There were so many things and people there that even took us an hour to walk the entire place. Some things were a bit pricey in my opinion, but I have no idea if this is the standard here. I didn't buy anything though. Later, we decided to walk home and find the park behind the, ha behind the house. We've been talking about going for a couple of weeks, but sometimes the weather is just not friendly enough to go outside on the weekends. Sí, sí, este lente tiene otro foco. ¿Sí? Sí. Te busca la cara y te lo enfoca. <laughs> As you can see, it was beautiful and big. We couldn't walk it up, walk it up, because <laughs> we were already tired. But we definitely found a place to go and have a nice afternoon near home, which is really nice, honestly. starts and I try to plan some of the goals I want to tackle. I have been working on a couple of illustrations but also wanted to practice some topics just to know how to handle them in case I needed to for future projects or my own personal work. Then I went back to practice. This time I'm sketching some male portraits with reference from Pinterest, of course. All very basic and not to get my head around that much. Just wanted to practice different positions and different ethnicities too. It's something I have been thinking about incorporating in my work as a way to expand my universe and to gain more skills.
Hope you like the final results of this. I am actually very proud of them. New morning is here and one of the things I sometimes find very relaxing are the automated tasks like folding the clothing and putting them away. Last week, we finally get the cash for the living room. This was a battle. The first one we ordered did not arrive because it ran out of stock even though they sold it to us. So, yeah. And it was a bit disappointing because, you know, we were like waiting for it. And then we had to go back and hunt another cash that sort of meet our tastes and needs. Luckily we found this one, though we knew it was a bit bigger than our ideal measures, we bought it anyway. I'm sparing you from the torturous <laughs> um, ensemble, the couch situation that it was. But this is what it looks like. <laughs> I'm in love with the color, by the way. And though it's bigger than our expectations, we can both both sit or lay down and watch TV together without getting uncomfortable. So in the end, it was a total win for us. This week we are expecting a lot of packages, some are delayed from weeks before and some other were programmed to arrive the same day, so yay, it feels like Christmas sometimes. <laughs> Let's build the living room lamp. This was another of the things that I had to reorder because the first, first one got lost. I know. Amazon, what are you doing? But silver lining, I'm glad because this second lamp is more beautiful than the first one I ordered and it was the one that I originally wanted, so let's call it fate, I guess. <laughs> In the end, it was another of those things that I said it happens for a good reason. <laughs> yeah, we got now a beautiful lamp and we are very happy about it. So what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you unpacking? I'm going to go to the 
¿No tenía bombillo? No, no tenía bombillo. ¿Y qué bombillo? ¿Amarillo o blanco? Let's place the lamp where she belongs and try to see if she works properly. So far I didn't taste it until I had it assembled. Um, anyway, thanks to the universe this worked out pretty fine. Also, the rock for the TV area is here, but that one is a bit harder to set since we have to lift the couch and move some stuff, so I guess it will be done in the weekend. Anyway, you will know when you see this if we did it or not. <laughs> Some things that everyone is, seems to be obsessed these days is cable management. So I'm trying to hide the cable for the lamp so it looks more clean and organized and more visually pleasant. My husband had the brilliant idea to use double side tape that we had already in the house, paste the cable to the leg of the lamp, one of the legs of the lamp. And it worked like pearls, guys. Totally a great suggestion. We finally set up the rug in the weekend. This was on Saturday, if I'm not wrong.
over here we have the final look and now we have this very cozy small area to watch TV and lay down in the nights or after the workday is done we are really happy and we are enjoying this small space in the house and feel like it's starting to come together feeling more like our home so we're very happy well if you made it this far thank you so much for watching the video today i hope you enjoyed the content i am still working on learning and trying to make it better videos for you guys uh, soon i will be releasing a art related content because you know that's what i do i'm an artist so if you liked it, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, uh, you can check my Instagram if you want to see more of my work. And thank you so much, have a great week!